is one of the most powerful players in the crypto industry. FTX filing for bankruptcy on yeah. Friday, a complete collapse, Bitcoin falling below $17,000 on the news. When you are under financial stress, you sell what you can sell. Right. So yes. if, you have, if you owe money here because of crypto and I have liquidity here in the stock market, I'm going to have to sell my stock. So is there a contagion effect? I actually don't think there is because I think it's a very specific buyer of crypto. Maybe if you're a millennial in your 30s and you, know, you probably don't own a lot of Exxon, you probably don't own a lot of IBM and Microsoft on all those old school stocks, then yes, you're probably having problems. But look, market's been ramping the last two weeks and crypto literally just you know, collapsed. So I think it's a very, very different world. And that's why it's DeFi versus actually in the financial system, like when we had the housing crisis and everything was embedded actually in the financial system that's regulated. So yeah, I think bottom line is it's not really going to affect um, what's happening in the, in the real world, in the real market. Crypto has always been fake, in my opinion. Um, I've said it on your show many, many times. And I wouldn't be surprised if you see it literally become almost worthless. So, wow. I mean, yeah. look, there's going to be a lot of money lost if that's the case. Yeah. This is being called the Lehman Brothers moment for crypto. For crypto. Yeah. Yeah, which is a much smaller market, to your point, um, built on delusion and greed, right? <laughs> if I put it put that way, and I think the bottom line here is, like, I think Warren Buffett said it best. You give me $25 of Bitcoin, I'll take the 25 bucks. Right. So I, I think the bottom line it is, is obviously contained here. And even if you look at it globally, I mean, the emerging markets, developed markets have had a huge run the last two weeks, which says to me, globally, it's not even impacting what's going on in the real capital market.